Hello, welcome in the ERP SAP team channel. Today we are going to discuss another tutorial to transfer the inventory from one location to another location. Location means one storage location to another storage location within the plant. Okay. So we are going to transfer this material code goods movement within the plant from SOD SLOC means storage location 1000 to 2000 so we are going to follow the uh, SAP menu path from logistic to material management to inventory management to the goods movement then transfer posting others movement type 311 okay so then the next step is you need to check these details in mb52 check the stock at the source location source storage location and destination storage location before and after the posting and the check posting MIGO document uh, using mb51 okay this is 311 movement type 311 movement type 301 is used for uh, plan to plan transfer but before uh, you are going to transfer plan to plan, then you need to get the higher approval from the competent authority. Because uh, once you are going to transfer the inventory from one plant to another plant, there is a standard procedure to create the stock transfer order. And then you need to transfer the material uh, with respect to purchase order. Purchase order created by receiving plant. Okay. So we are going to uh, follow the SAP menu path that is logistic that is inventory management and that is uh, goods movement and uh, here we have a uh, transfer posting uh, lot, lots of option we have okay so if you are ex if you are going to explore the SAP menu path, then you will get a lot of options. Uh, we are going to check the MB52. MB in MB52, we are uh, filling the plan code, material code. Okay. In 2000 storage location, we have one number of the quantity of this material. Okay. We have one number of the quantity at uh, 2000 storage location and now we are going to check the same quantity at the 1000 storage location. Okay, we are going to check the quantity at the 1000 storage location and 1000 storage location we have a 97 quantity and that is the requirement of the one quantity at the 2000 storage location. So we are going to transfer this goods movement. Okay. SAP is very simplest software and the among the best software in the world for the inventory management. And you can track your each and every amount of the inventory if you are doing proper entry in the SAP, posting the SAP documents regularly at the time of the moments, at the time of good receipt, at the time of the goods issue. Okay, so. Uh, we are going to uh, use the MIGO transaction code, transfer posting other, uh, 311 within the plant, okay. And uh, here you need to fill the document header text, material movement from 1000 to 2000, okay. Material movement from 1000 storage location to 2000 storage location. Now you need to fill the material code that is the ball bearing requirement and uh, you need to fill the material code at the source from 2 to okay this material code you need to fill the material code you need to fill the plan code that is 3002 you need to full, fill the from storage location sender storage location and you need to fill the quantity that is the one numbers of the quantity i just want to transfer from the thousand storage location to uh, two thousand storage location okay 
and you need to fill the interview. See, once you fill the enter, then from and destination SLOC data will be reflecting here. Uh, once you enter, you can also verify the material code and uh, from main store to the this store in the quantity one numbers. Okay, in the where you need to fill the good recipient means ADMM ECM. Okay, and a loading point from where you are sending the data, uh, sending the material, okay? Then in, in text, you can mention anything, which is the suitable quantity uh, required for you, okay? So this is the way how you can manage the data, okay? And uh, here you need to click on the check. Once you check, then system will give you the message document is okay now you can uh, post this document and uh, this is the posting document posting MIGO document we have successfully transferred the material code from one storage location to another storage location using MIGO doc okay this is the document number and uh, post you can uh, You can also display this uh, document number using MB51. In MB51, uh, you need to fill uh, material code, plant code, storage location. And the system will give you the data of the material movement. See? This is the material document number. Okay. Posted on 12-12-2021. So in MB51, you have a record of the posting document. You can filter out all those documents using moment type because we have successfully transferred the uh, data from uh, moment type uh, 311. You can filter out the moment type. You will get out the requisite data. And uh, on the basis of date, on the basis of period of the transactions, on the basis of the entry in the stock registered by the MM in charge of the concern storage location, you will get the data. Now you can <clears throat> also check this uh, in the 2000 storage location. Uh, in the 1000, we have 97, so it's 96. Okay, in 2000, we have one, then now it's two, one quantity increases. So, whole picture of the material movement is uh, displaying here okay the second method this is the second method this is the secondary method but if you want to um, urgent transfer of the quantity and if you have a sufficient role of the storage locations transfer posting and amigo then you you can transfer the document from one storage location to another storage location generally <clears throat> for the requirement of the material from the main store we need to create the reservation number and against the reservation from the main store in charge will issue that material and you can receive the material against the MIGO document okay so reservation process is very uh, good process but this process is also a very popular process from the transfer of the <coughs> inventory from one story location to another story location if you have any query on your mind please mention in the comment section please share this knowledge with your friends and colleagues because knowledge sharing is getting and this is purely understanding and uh, knowledge understanding purpose tutorial okay for an understanding and training purpose okay SAP MM is very good module for the inventory management and Thank you. Have a nice day.